Hey everyone, it's Bailey from Making Up the Midwest and it's time for the February Birch Box. That was like awkward slow. Sorry about that. But it's true, it's time. And before I get into it, I wanted to talk about how I'm especially eager for this one because they seem to have put out more teasers. They put out their spoiler video, which kind of a spoiler. You knew you were going to get one, at least one of the big things that were was in it. Um, and then they put out a ton of tutorials showing you how to use those things as well as other tutorials. And so they really just built a suspenser th for me this month. And I was, I'm pretty, pretty happy to get, to get to opening this little thing. Let me know what you think about it. If you're not a spoilers person, that probably didn't do much for you. But, um, I don't know. I'm just especially excited to open this box this month. So let's see what's inside. All right, so here is this card for the month. It says Spotlight, and it's all about you. Although, isn't it always all about you, us, we, those who receive the box? You know what I'm saying. Uh, and let's just let's just start rolling with what's in here. Ooh, pretty silver paper this month here. Oh, ha, ha, ha. And here's my box. Oh, with the gold paper and a heart inside. Oh, the heart is in fact an emery board. It's double sided. Has that and a that. That looks like sandpaper, but this looks like nice. That's that's really, and then who doesn't need an emery board? I always need one. So the first, let's get to the first thing, and that is the, um, I wanna say black denim. They took all the vowels out, but if you see right there, it looks like it says black denim, and that is this little guy. And as many of you will know, I love getting sample fragrances because one, they're perfect for travel, and two, they give you enough time to wear it around, see how it changes with your um, own chemistry and see how it smells on you. And I just love that. I do really like a good sample size perfume. Ah! And the other thing I love is if a sample has the spritzy, the, the, you know, that and not the way to dab it on your wrist, that's a big pain in the butt. So this is nice. Let me tell you what the scent is like. It says New York's hippest denim brand created this spicy perfume. Wear it for a dose of downtown cool. Um, I like spice. I can dig spice. I can't smell it, but I can dig spice. Let's try and... Oh, good. I fail. Ooh. Oh. That's lovely. But it kind of smells like a men's fragrance. It's a little bit musky. And I know some women love wearing men's fragrances, um, so this might be for them. I'll have to... I'll have to see how I feel about it. I don't like sweet things, but I also don't like... It's, it's very musky. Very... Uh, musky. But like I said before, you have to wear it around, see how it reacts to your skin and your chemistry. So we'll we'll see how that changes. If you have this, if you've got this in your box and have tried it and love it or don't love it, I'd love to hear in the comments. The next product is this Exude Lip Cream. And this looks like another full-size, yeah, looks like a full-size product. I don't know exactly how... Well, let's read it. Let's just see. It says, Exude Lip Cream. Buzz alert. Mega stylist Rachel Zoe swears by this bold lipstick, which has an innovative crystal applicator that dispenses the exact amount of lipstick you need. Full size is $29. So, I, yeah, I don't know if this is a full size. It's 2.6 mils. It looks like a full size to me. Let me, hold on. Let me take this off and put this on and show you what it looks like. So that's in the color Nude. Um, this isn't on my lips, but I feel like the product I was wearing before didn't come off completely, so I also put a little bit on my hand. And here you can see, let's zoom in a little bit. Oh, there are the lips. But then here is also the Nude. It's very sparkly, if you can see. Very, very sparkly. So that is that. Um, and the nice thing I noticed when I was putting it on is that this crystal applicator, because it's shaped like a lipstick in a lipstick shape, it's easy to get this little Cupid's bow area more so than a regular lip gloss applicator. It tastes minty. It's the slightest bit gritty because it has some of that shimmer in it, so it's not the smoothest thing I've ever felt, but it's not annoyingly gritty, if that makes sense. If you catch my drift. Um, so that is my initial analysis of this, this guy. It's nice though, and I love the packaging. It's kind of a matte, not rub, kind of like NARS, but white. I love NARS packaging. It's very much like that. There's a little exude focus there so that's that let's move on oh i am so happy for this next product this this they're the irock right irock designer liner the eye tattoo kind of things uh this was one of the three or four things that they showed in their spoilers video it was this or the lip tattoo the um violet lips lip tattoo the lipstick might have been in there and then the beauty blender some people might have gotten the beauty blender this month spoiler alert sorry um and i got the eye tattoo which i am i would have happy to have gotten all of them. I don't know if that's grammatically correct. You know what I'm saying. Um, 
but I got these and I'm very happy about it. So let me see, let me read. It says, I rock designer liner. Stop wrestling with the liquid liner and achieve a perfect cat eye with these single use stick on liner strips. And two packs of four are $13. This is a pack of four. So two of these, $13, which is, I mean, eight looks for 13 bucks. And I had been so tempted to try these ever since Dior came out with theirs. I think before fall, they came out with um, the first, I, don't, I actually don't know if they're the first, but they're the first I ever saw of the eye tattoo. And I was so tempted to try them, but they were 60 bucks for four. These are eight for 13. Eight for 13, ridiculous people. So I'll see how easy they are to apply in the video, the application video they put up, Birchbox did. Uh, they showed that you had to kind of cut them to make them fit your eye in order to make these universally fitting to every eye shape. They, you kind of have to trim them just like you do with violent lips. But it'll be interesting to see how easy the application process is. But look, you have these are all kinds of practical, but then you have a little bit of flair here and the kind of flair that you, I personally could not perfect freehanding myself. So I will have, I'll probably do a review and kind of rate the application process on my blog. And then if it's super, super weird or hard or there are some tricks that I have found to be helpful in applying these, I might make a video. We don't actually, no one knows. Uh, but look for that. Definitely a blog post at the very least showing them on my eyes. The last thing, oh, there are two extras, but the last like big thing in my box was the LA Fresh Eco Beauty Acetone Free Nail Polish Remover. And you get two little, I got two little packets of these. And it says, leave the cotton balls and acetone behind. These convenient pads dissolve polish with a natural mix of botanicals plus soothing aloe vera which is always nice because I don't know if, about you, but sometimes I find my cuticles getting really dry if I've been polishing and removing a lot. So soothing is always nice. And you get two testers with these. Shoot, my nails are chipping anyway. I'm gonna go ahead and try this. Let's just do it. I have two packs so I can do it more than once. And So here it is, not to huff it, but it doesn't smell bad. It doesn't, it has a tinge like any nail polish remover, but not, overwhelmingly it's not like whoa that's nail polish remover it's kind of pleasant smelling I can't really think okay so here is my chipped nail this is Deborah Lippman by the way so it's a pretty solid sturdy nail polish um, and I'm just going to chat you through this that way you know in real time how long it takes okay maybe not real time this might take forever oh no look at that wow interesting sorry if you didn't want to sit through this you can fast forward all right, I don't know how many seconds that took, but it's gone. And there it is, and yeah, I like it overall. Well, that's neat, and it's all natural. So if you're very into all natural or you're looking to try all natural things, LA Fresh, It's so far it's working, I like it. Oh, this little nail file was a lifestyle extra. There's no shame in filing your nails in public with this heart-shaped neon looker. That's so true, so cute. And then the last thing is a Birchbox digital download, and that's this card, six free tunes from Green River Ordinance, an indie rock band poised to hit the spotlight. So this, it looks like you go download the tracks for free and it gives you a little URL. I'll put the URL in the bottom bar um, just in case you don't um, get Birchbox. It says these Texas Charmers are our latest music discovery. Their catchy tunes keep us going throughout the day and they are Green River Ordinance again. So again, link at the bottom bar. That is it for my February Birch Box. So I hope you all enjoyed that. I'd love to hear what you got in yours. As usual, please put all of your comments, questions, tell me what you got in the bottom bar because I want to hear it. So thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye.